Hi everyone, my name is Eddie Zaratsian. I'm an event and floral designer. In today's episode, I'm going to show you how to make this arrangement called Angel's Wing. Let's go back into my workshop area and I'm going to show you how this is done. Today's arrangement that I'm going to be making for you, I'm calling it the Angel Wing. Taking a really simple tin container that always has a liner already, I'm going to take my floral foam that is pre-soaked and I'm going to take three different types of flowers. First, Niren, Dusty Miller, and Rice Flower. So let me show you how I'm going to start this. This is already pre-lined. I'm going to start with my cut oasis right here. And then I'm going to take the other larger piece. I'm going to cut it three quarters, like so. Oh, it's a little too big. Narrow it a little bit. Put it in here like so, and I'm ready to rock and roll. Let me get rid of these. So I'll start with our first flower, and I'm going to clean out a little bit of the yellow tips. This is when it's growing, it's protecting it, it kind of um, opens up like a cocoon. So I'm going to clean this off so you can actually gently see the flowers. And then I'm going to insert them inside the foam after cutting them at an angle. And I'm going to do one length. And I'm going to insert them all in one level. I'm going to finish this off completely with going to the parameter of it and also the center so they're all kind of um, lined up in one straight platform. And then I'll show you how to finish the rest of it. So let me finish this up and then you'll come back and see it inserted with all these beautiful blooms. almost finished with the insertions of my Niren and I'm going to put two more and then I'm going to start with putting my rice flour and then my Dusty Miller. Look how gorgeous this is coming out to be. So now I'm going to take my rice flour and I'm going to cut it and I'm going to insert it really 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 tightly inside the center and the parameter of it to fill up the gaps of the oasis like so. And I'm going to play a little bit around with the Dusty Miller to make sure it's what I want it to be. If not, then I might just nix the Dusty Miller. But I think it looks great. So I'm going to cut them up like this. They look a little weak. So by cutting them up from the stem and then recutting them and putting them in a foam, it actually is making them a little bit stronger. See? And what I love about Dusty Miller, it has that velvety texture, the gray tone, which you don't see that in many foliages and greenery. Like that. And like so. I think I'm going to do one more of the Dusty Miller and I'm going to call it a day on this Dusty Miller. Now I'm going to finish off with my rice flour in between all of that. And we're going to have a beautiful angel wing arrangement for the holidays. It can be for the winter. You can add quite a few different elements in here to bring it out. You can float pine cones in there or, you know, lay pine cones in there as well. So beautiful. And I'm going to go back and I'm going to use a little bit more Dusty Miller because I thought I wasn't going to need it, but I do need it. And that's it. And look at this beautiful angel wing arrangement. For more information my video tutorials, go to my YouTube page, Eddie Zaratzin, and I'll see you next time.